And I'm not actually going to show the video tonight, Lady C, because I don't think it's fair. But he's actually copying a lot of abuse online about the fact that he was annoyed regarding a pen at the ceremony earlier today. And I just think, lay off this guy. He's just lost his mum. He's been working non-stop. It was a momentary lapse. And I think the criticism has actually been uh, highly uncalled for. Well, I think it's actually preposterous. You know, why would people criticise him? I mean, how, most people, of course, who are criticising him have never used a fountain pen in their life. And they don't understand that a fountain pen that leaks not only damages the document, but it dribbles ink all over you and possibly all over your clothes. It is extremely irritating. And I will say one thing in defense of the king, that he, yes, he is quick to anger, but he is a very warm and kind and loving and conscientious person. And if he shows his annoyance, that is simply the fact that he is honest, forthright, and forthcoming. And why wouldn't he be annoyed? I would put it to you that practically anybody else in his shoes would have been annoyed, aside from the fact that he is dog-tired. I know this from people who are close to the situation. He is totally run out. And not only is he totally run out, but he has to be making extremely important political moves and speeches. You know, it wasn't easy to go to Belfast and strike the right note throughout. Look at the way he waded into the crowds. You know, I mean, I'm sorry. We have much to praise him for and nothing to criticise him for. Just because he was annoyed that the pen was leaking, the pen shouldn't have been leaking. You know, it's as simple as that. And But everybody, there's a, there's a segment of the population that loves to condemn and does it quite frankly, ill-advisedly and sometimes plain, plumb, stupidly.